guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ali. if you have not been here before, and thank you so much for watching this video. I asked you guys what you wanted to see from me in the future, and I had a lot of requests for spring content, so I'm very excited to share a bit of a spring lookbook, some spring outfits, all styled with new pieces from Petal and Pup. First off, I want to say a huge thank you to Petal and Pup for sponsoring this video. And of course, because they are so awesome, they created a discount code for you guys to use. So you guys can use the code ALLY20 for 20% off all orders through April 24th. And there are new arrivals landing weekly, which I'm telling you guys, everything is so cute. And I also think it's really cool that Petal and Pup is a female-founded brand as well. So definitely give them a little bit of support, especially during the spring season. I know I'm very excited. Everything is so cute. Before I get into the adorable looks, please make sure you subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Hit that notification bell so you're notified every single time I upload. If you guys enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I would really, really appreciate that and leave a comment down below letting me know what your favorite outfit from this little lookbook is. As always, I will definitely link all the petal and pup pieces that I'm talking about today down in the description box. My Instagram's also down there if you guys wouldn't mind giving me a follow, especially if you guys want to see these pieces styled. And that's it. Let's go ahead and get into the lookbook. All right, we have to start out with this beautiful little top that I'm wearing right now. My jeans are not making sitting the most comfortable. I'd really, really like to unbutton them, but I'm not gonna do that, you guys. We're gonna try and keep it fresh here. Okay, let, okay, let's talk about the top. So this top is so freaking cute. Obviously, you can see it on right now. Floral print is just spring in a top. I love all the flowers all around it. I love like the muted kind of pastel look it's got to it. The little ruffles down at the sleeve here. They've got kind of like nice poofy sleeves too that you can wear a couple different ways. So you can wear them all the way up like this. You can wear them like draped on the shoulders like so or you could even wear it down like this as well. You guys will be able to see it better in the try on but it actually ties in the back as well which I think is so cute. And this top actually has a matching skirt as well, which I'll be sure to link that down below in case you guys want to have a matchy matchy moment. But for me, I really wanted to style this beautiful top with a pair of jeans. So I opted for a nice high rise pair of white denim that had a nice little flare to the bottom, a little distressing on the hemline as well. And I thought this look would be very cute for like a brunchy kind of vibe. So I opted for some really cute chunky heels, a little bag to match, and I think the outfit it really came together in such a special way. I feel like the versatility of this top is just so great. You can dress it up and dress it down and I'm looking forward to trying so many different outfits for this little top. Let's move on to some dresses because I don't know about you guys but like dresses are like so quintessential spring to me. I love a dress in the springtime and this one I think is just so great. So as you guys can hopefully maybe see, it's got a cute little very dainty floral print to it as well. This one's obviously a lot smaller, but I think it is so cute. It's almost like a brownish, kind of orangish kind of color mixed in with some beautiful cream. And I just absolutely love the silhouette of this. It's kind of like almost short sleeve, but not quite little sleeves on it. And it does have like a V neckline and these cute little buttons down the front. And I just love how it like kind of A-lines out. It's got some like really cute ruffly details to it. It's very girly and very, very springy. So for this one, I wanted to style it a little bit more casual. You can obviously go for like heels or boots with this kind of dress, but I went with sneakers. I also love layering in the spring, so I decided to pop on a nice big oversized denim jacket over it and I wanted to add a little hair accessory as well because Petal and Pop has a lot of cute ones. So I opted for this little blue scrunchie. It's got these cute little daisies all around it and obviously these prints don't exactly like match but I love print mixing so I think it really works together. I love a little scrunchie for just throwing up your hair on like a bad hair day or on a gray hair day, you just like really feel like adding hair accessory. This scrunchie is so cute and I really, really love how the outfit kind of came together. While we're on the topic of dresses, I have to show you guys this amazing dress. First of all, the silhouette is just adorable and the perfect 
type of a dress to wear when you're gonna like eat a ton because you're not gonna see your shape at all. Definitely very billowy and big, but I love the silhouette so much. Got these cute little ties on the top, which make it very convenient for resizing the straps and all these little ruffles are just so adorable. The print is so cute too. And I've decided to keep this look a little bit more simple. There's obviously many ways you can style this dress, like with sneakers would look super cute and with heels as well, maybe even boots. But I want to go for a very simple pair of like little strappy sandals and just a cute bag to match. I can see myself going out like shopping with my mom and sister in this kind of look or out for a little girl's lunch or something. I think this dress is so perfect. And again, another very versatile piece that I will definitely be wearing a ton this spring. <laughs> Next up, I could not get over how adorable this little skirt is it's kind of like a muted mint green color and it's got a very cute little a-line effect to it very like 60s i think i'm in the right era 60s ish somebody correct me if i'm wrong but i love the big pockets i think they are so fun this material is very comfortable too so i feel like secure enough like where it's tight and like it feels like it fits my body well but it's not like suffocating me at the same time i wish i was wearing this skirt right now not these jeans but i do feel suffocated anyways it's got a little zipper in the back as well and i decided to kind of like spice up this skirt a little bit because it is very simple so i decided to wear a cute pair of cow print boots I think they look really, really fun with this skirt. And then I just went for a very simple top because I didn't want to compete with the boots too much. So I thought the little cropped button down top was perfect for this skirt. And just a super simple little black bag with a pair of sunglasses on my head. And I feel super cute in this little spring outfit. So again, it's not like your stereotypical type of spring outfit, but this mint green I think is super super spring like so you don't have to like go for the obvious when it comes to spring looks i think it's fun to kind of like play on the colors of spring um while like still adding some funk and adding some prints in there so yeah i really love how this outfit came out lastly this is gonna be funny that i'm just like talking about this clip but i got this clip and i was like okay i want to style a really cute look around something simple like this and a lot of times I do get asked like okay how how do you put outfits together like how do you style a complete look and oftentimes it is just one piece that starts the whole thing so whether it's like a top or a dress or even just a hair accessory I will start with the one piece and I will build my look around that like okay so where am I going what's the temperature gonna be like um, do I want to be really comfortable? Do I want to feel really dressed up? Like, what is the occasion, I guess? But I love this little clog clip. It's very 90s. And I wanted to style a very comfortable, just easy kind of throw-on look. Um, because I think that these clips are just kind of like representative of that. Like, just throwing up your hair in a clip and it feeling cute and put together. But obviously, if you're not having the best hair day, you feel super confident because you have a cute little accessory. So, I decided to do something a little bit more sporty. And I love how this look came together. So, starting out with the blue color in this clip, I was like, okay. So, for a cute little blue top. So, I went for a plaid little button down, threw on a cute little white crop top underneath, a pair of high rise black shorts, and a, just a pair of sneakers. And the outfit came together so seamlessly. It's super cute. It's something that I would feel really comfortable in the springtime wearing, especially because the weather is like warm, but it can definitely, especially here, get like breezy during the springtime. So I'm a little bit cooler. So having that cute little plaid button down on over the outfit, I think really brings it together and obviously it just practically makes sense. So this outfit I feel is so fun for a spring training game or just honestly, whatever. It's very comfortable and very casual, but still like put together. So I think honestly, the clip really is what does it for me with this outfit. So cute, but obviously practical at the same time. 
Alright you guys, that is it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little spring luck book. If you guys did, do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. Let me know which outfit is your favorite and do not forget to use my code ally 20 for 20% off your order at Petal and Pup through April 24th and I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!